That's a natural Fuck 20. Yeah. Uh, roll damage with critical hit. You have another You have it. another attack and, and a bonus action. You can just keep hitting it. Though. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Uh, another critical hit. Oh what my is god. This damage? If it's on one. No. It is exactly one. So it's a one hit HP. I spent key points to do fire of blows and attack him twice. That is a miss. Oh no. no. Oh, I, I can't no. believe this. Oh my god. What? It's another crit. It's another crit. <laughs> Are you insane? Wait, wait, it's how long? that. Eat that dragon. Eat that. That is Roll. three critical hits in a row. You just knocked the dragon's head off. The damage rolls were really low. That is true. Even on a critical hit. Like, you rolled really shit. But honestly, like, the critical hey, hits, I, I got the job done. They fucking saved your ass, man. Now I feel like an asshole for running away, to be honest. <laughs> well, you didn't know that uh, Platinum no would uh, explode himself into the inside of the dragon. I mean... I didn't expect him to vort himself and blow himself up. Exactly. I mean, I'm glad I'm a rogue and was able to survive that. <laughs> You're so freaking lucky. Every Every time you save, also, I just want to, so uh, my I'm seeing all of this, by the way. My familiar is in the middle, and I'm just looking through his eyes. Like, oh, yeah, sure. Fuck is going well, on? Kaylin, it's your turn. Is Basically, oh, everyone yeah. is dead. You only see Absolution uh, cro on the dragon's corpse. That's um, the only person you see. Uh, he is currently 50 feet away from you. Uh, you I did not expect Plaid to have such a Wait, freaking... all three of my, crit my critical hits on one I of the dice, they, expect... they rolled one. They rolled a one on one of the die for each of the damage. You are, Every single that's one. That's really unlucky, man. I got unlucky, a one on each of the die. I mean, you were tired, man. You just got sentenced to your hole, man. For relax. Holy shit. <laughs> well, what are you What are you doing, Kellen? Um, well, you can do uh, you can do double your um, uh, movement, but because it's d difficult terrain, it's 15 feet, so it would be 30 feet. So you can do a um, movement 15 feet and then a bonus action 15 feet. So you can move 30 feet and then still have an action to attack, basically, if you want yeah. to. Yeah, I'm just... I wouldn't be able to sneak attack. Uh, that is correct. Yeah. Or would Absolution uh, expect to be attacked again? <laughs> so I'm I... gonna give you. I'm gonna give him an insight, and he has to. Yeah, the 18 is is enough. He's he knows you're the baddie in this instance. It's like uh, daggers are 20 feet, so you have to be within 20 feet. But with with the um thing, you can get exactly within 20 feet. Uh, with um movement and dash, a bonus yeah, action. Yeah, but yes, but if I uh, instead use hide. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, okay. Bonus action, I would be able to uh, do a sneak attack. And At disadvantage, yes, then it would cancel out, so it would be a normal roll, yes. Okay, well, because yeah, you yeah, would yeah. get advantage because you're hidden, but yeah. because you're so far away, you would get disadvantage, so it just cancels out, so you get normal, but you still get sneak attack because you're hidden. Uh, so, uh, yeah, go ahead and uh, roll a stealth check. A stealth check? Yes, it does a stealth check. I mean, make a make a um, perception, I mean, it's not, it, this is, it has to be a natural 20, otherwise you don't see him. Uh, absolution. If you roll a natural 20, I'm not going to give him sneak attack. If you roll anything but a natural 20, you it's not a thing. You have to do a perception check. Yeah, you don't see him. So, um, yeah, you get... Uh, it's a normal roll, but you get sneak attack. So the first one hits with sneak attack and uh, and normal damage. You have deflect missiles, um, I see. Oh, I do. As long as it's... Uh... Yes, it's a ranged a weapon, point. so you I can, can use a key point to catch it and throw it back. Yes, so um, you can reduce the attack damage by one d10 plus your dexterity modifier plus your monk level. I'm sorry, what? Yes, so uh, so just just roll just roll a d10, just roll a d10. So that's gonna be 20 damage, uh, and then also it's uh, five, so that's gonna be 15 damage, and then the monk level is 11, so that's gonna be nine damage. So you take another nine damage instead of the 28. Uh, how can I take specific? Uh, you just damage? you can just. I, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just. Gonna, you have nine hit points. Left. Barely in there. That is so basically. But not dead. But not dead. Yes, not Kalen. Dead. Kalen basically like, he just like sh sneaks in the shadows. You didn't reckon like notice him anyway because like you were on the fucking dragon bashing him, and then all of a sudden a dagger comes th thrown towards you. You're like, what the heck was that? And then the second dagger like strikes you almost exactly like in the heart, but like just barely before that you just like you you grab it, and it barely that like. By an inch, not pierces your heart, and you see, um, okay. killing that for, for the dagger. Do everything again. Yes, Smoke and Joe, it is your turn. You just saw Absolution absolutely completely obliterate the dragon. And I've been tracking where my familiar entire time over, <laughs> uh, where Boyle's dead corpse. Sure, okay, right. right, and cool thing about my familiar. If it gets in touch, it can cast spells. <laughs> oh my god. You said it has 40 feet of how long it Oh my god, you are absolutely insane. Yes, <laughs> yes. And I know, I know so have one spell left. Yes, so... And I have one spell okay, left. Okay, you can... Okay, so let me just guess. You want to 
push your familiar to Kaelin and then cast a spell. Wait, what do you want to cast? That is a question. A few things. I can either just Eldritch Blast. However, what I think would be a, a bit funnier, just just so I could... He's still standing, like, he's still doing, like, pretty well, all things considered. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I want to make it he run straight to his face, and I think the best thing I can do is cast an Eldritch Blast right in his face. So, you're going to do... You're going to try to cast three Eldritch Blasts in his face? Yeah. Sure. So, uh, the you, you can see the bird um, of the phoenix from... Um, uh, from Smoke and Joe, basically in the middle of the cavern, all of a sudden turns around and, like, even with the wings, like, unfolded, it strangely looks like a middle finger. And all of a sudden, <laughs> three middle fingers just blast towards you. Uh, roll, uh, roll three attacks against Caitlyn. The first one's gonna hit. The second one's gonna hit. That is not gonna hit, sadly. So, Damn. that's gonna be two hits against Caitlyn. Uh, that is not Damn. right. That is n That should not be 1d10. 5d10? Oh. Yes, I'm pretty sure it should be. Yes, because it's a fifth level spell. That's 26 there damage to you, and then the second time, the second hit, another 5d10. We get the whole 50 damage. And it happened again. Wow. <laughs> there you go. Wow. That's... Um, Can I... Is there any kind of stamina draw I can do? Yes, or... you can You can, um, uh, You can. can do 13 on the first one if you use oh, your no. reaction to do... Um... These aren't projectiles. My familiar can only activate spells no, when they're it's... in touch. No, 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 no. no. Yes, yeah, the, the he can still do it. He can still, he can still half it. So you can half the first one. Yeah, I'm gonna... Uh, if you, uh, if you burn a reaction. Yeah, I'm gonna half the first one, so it's... Uh, the first one is uh, half damage. Not really. I mean, you can just move, basically. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I'll just start moving. And a bonus closer. action. If you can, you can... If you still have a potion, you can take a potion. Yeah, I guess I'm closer. Um, that is gonna be the cultist leader, then. Who's gonna do a charisma save. Wait, who did who did the banishing? Smoke and Joe. I, I you taken. absolute p wow all right frick me man okay he's still gone he's back he's back. Oh. barely hit it yeah so <laughs> that's a 19 <laughs> but right that's, oh, it's gonna be at the end of his turn so nothing happens uh but he's back Mindale's dead boyo <laughs> is going to make a death saving throw that is going to be a death save and that's gonna be a 17 that's a success he's back nope that boyo. is not how this works no that's not how um and then Somebody it goes to kill. kia which is she also makes a death saving throw, and she also succeeds. All right, there you go. And then it is back to absolution. Um, hmm. I feel like it'd be wise. So right now, give. right next to you, uh, uh, the cultist leader appeared again. If I want to run, this is really yeah, bad. Thinking, this is a... I'm thinking I run and then heal because I can get. I get. And also, uh, Kia and Boyo are still. They are still alive. They are still breathing. However, they are like at death's door. They have to fail three death saving. Yes, and if they succeed right. the three death saving throws, then they are um, then they are uh, they are back on one. Eight. Right, I, I'm gonna do my my two attacks then, and I will try and get a stun on the cultist leader before I run away. All right, go for it. Uh, twenty six. That's gonna hit. Yeah, absolutely. Um, gonna make a Constitution saving throw. Uh, I think that saves against your DC. I think your DC is uh twelve, if I recall. But he is going to take the damage. I get plus two to DC, I think, because of okay. um, But I think that the 17 still, then still saves. Um, but you can attack again, and um, you can do another um, stunning strike. Yeah, another try on the... Absolutely, go for it. Can I, I, can I use Potion of Superior Healing and then retreat? Heal for 29. Absolutely, that's 29. And uh, and then I can move. So I can move... Uh, you can move 20, 40 feet, I, because you are unimpeded by the... 20 feet. That's tw that should be 20 feet. Uh, then it's going back to Kaelin. Uh, the... Um, yeah, and you were just cool blasted retreat. in the face by the by the familiar of um, Smoke and Joe, uh, which would be yeah. the only thing that's that that's right up in your face, so you could attack the Phoenix if you wanted to. You can't use physical attacks. Why not? No, of course you can. Can I use magical attacks on it? Yes. Yes. Or magical yeah. weapons on it. The magic weapon would hit. Yes. That that works. Are you gonna do it? Okay. Um. First of all, I'm gonna heal. All right. Go for it. Using uh, the superior healing potion. Uh, this is actually crazy. Yeah. I didn't think that it would be a, a, a war of attrition here at the end. Uh, all right. So that's towards the towards the uh, phoenix. Yeah. Absolutely. Go for it. Just do two attacks. That's natural twenty, and that uh, would in this case not hit. Uh, actually, you get bonuses, so it actually both of them hit. So the first one is critical hit, and then the second one. Uh, smoking... These crit rolls that absolutely insane. Yeah, they are like really bad. <laughs> you kinda, yeah. You kind of don't want a crit at this point, man. <laughs> uh, Smoke and Joe, yes. as you're looking through your familiar's eyes, uh, and after you attacked Caitlyn, the absolute bastard that stabbed you in the in the back, you see two daggers flow, fly towards your beloved bird, and you just hear, <coughs> and you can no longer look through the eyes of the Jeffrey! bird. Jeffrey! That's his name, by the way. I named him Jeffrey. Don't ask. Jeffrey. Um, 
All right. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be uh, Kalen's turn. Uh, or if you wanna, I mean, I, you, there's not my, that much you can do. Um, I that was actually a... can't do anything anymore. Yeah. I moved, I attacked, and I used my bonus Smoke, action. Smoke and Joe. Well, I'm gonna first off. I'm just keep walking. Feet. You can use your um. You can use a, an action to to double that, right? You know that, right? You can run. You can, but there's a cultist. So I think I'm just gonna start blasting while I run to. Um, I don't care the cultist. You. Only have yeah uh, no that's fine. Wait a second, uh, eldritch blast doesn't count against your uh, magic. You still have a magic. Okay, sorry. That's, uh, I, yeah, 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 because it's, it's a it's cantrip. Yeah, I didn't. Cantrip. Uh, it's fine. You're, you're fine. You're fine. So three attacks against a cultist. All three hit. All damage. Wait, that's still broke. Yeah, I don't know. Just do just do it manually uh, right now. I don't know why it's broken. Oh my god, you might kill him with this continues. Yes, come on, come on. Oh my god. Please tell me he's gone. Nope, he is not. He has he's the tiniest 15, bit of He has 15 left. life left. Between us, we can surely clean up Kaelin. Surely. I mean, we'll Ooh. see. Uh, is that it? Uh, Again, I don't think I have anything to do as a I don't think you do, no. Yeah, you don't have anything. Uh, All right. Uh, so that's going to be the cultist leader's turn. He's going to... Oh no, what is he going to do? He's going to cast Ice Storm. Rightly, right on top of you, um, Smoke and Joe. So you must make uh, a DC 17 saving throw. I Dexterity. automatically have damage because I bring. Oh fuck! I forgot it. Fuck. And I save against it anyway, so I take a quarter yeah, it's, damage. It, no, it's it's no damage it, we, because it's like half and half. It's it, it's no damage. Uh, okay, so I take no that. So basically, the the icicles fall on top of me, but as I'm running towards them, they just melt the second they touch me. They were they were baby icicles. He baby. is going to move back. Boil. Does a, another death saving throw. And he's going to succeed again. Uh, and then it's Kia's turn. And Kia also does a death saving throw. Does this zoom in by And she's going to fail one of them. There you go. Uh, and then it is Absolution's turn. Uh, you just heard... <laughs> outside of the... Like, you know, something was cast, basically. Right, so I'm going to move back to here, 20 feet. Yep. Um, I'm, I'm going to throw a dart... At the... uh, if you throw a dart from there, then you are at disadvantage. You would have to go Ooh. down three more tiles here. Okay. What? Well, then you can tiles. throw the dart. I can't without make it to the melee range. So. So you see so the cultist who's like clearly been branded with three middle fingers on various places. Yeah. You can attack twice with darts. Yes. Yeah. Well, you can throw two darts with your action, and then two more with your bonus. Uh, one more with your bonus action. But let's do the first. Uh, the two, first two. Well, I want to. I'm probably use my second healing potion for the. Yeah. Fair enough. But action. yeah. Then, so go for the two attacks. Right. That's gonna hit. That's also gonna hit. Yeah, both of them are gonna hit. Nice. Go roll for the roll damage. Come on, man. I can't not believe. Is he, he's on one HP, isn't he? He is on one HP. No way! Not again! It, you exactly killed him. It's exactly zero. Oh my god, oh yes. Oh my god. Right. No, I miscounted. First... No, it was 15. Can I roll for yeah. healing potion? You throw the two darts. The first dart hits him, like, on his left shoulder, and the second one just goes right through his mask, and he falls down on the ice. Kalen, we are coming for you, bitch. Oh my god. <laughs> awesome. Uh... Uh, <laughs> Kellen, it's your turn. Yeah. Um, so, by the way, where yes. the frick is the exit? Is it the uh, Well, so um, the exit is where Smoke and Joe is. However, uh, make a perception check. It, it doesn't cost you a, a turn or anything, but you can make a perception check to wow. maybe see. Where Smoke and Joe is, there's the exit. <laughs> I mean, sorry, with a five, it's just not. It's just not happening, yes. man. It's just not happening. It's I important investigate yes. uh, to see if I might have just uh, not perceived uh, an, another exit. If you do want to investigate, that would take your action. So you would it just would remain with, a, with movement and your bonus action. Oh. F <sighs> I gave you the perception for free, so that's the general idea. I know. But, but um, you can use you can use a the dash action as a bonus action as a roll. So do keep that in mind. Didn't you just say that? To oh, you said move and attack. That's what yes. Um, yeah. Okay. Then I'm just gonna investigate. All right. Uh, roll in an investigation check. It's uh, it's not. You don't. You got. You don't have anything. It's uh, you can't seem to find a different exit. You're like it has to be here, but you don't. <laughs> you don't know where it is. Good. Uh, wait, the, the left thingy here um, is that closed? Uh, well, that would be the thing that you would have perceived if you would have perceived oh. the big ex big exit. Yeah, but you you're not sure right now. It's just a bunch of rubble, and you're not sure if you can like what it is. The icicles are gone, and you were free to do whatever you want to do. So with um with your um you can do thirty you can move thirty feet with uh with the dash action. Yeah, but I I I I, I can't actually right. I'll just dash 30 right next to you. You're gonna feed her the um 
healing potion. Can I just feed with the potion? It's a, it's a, it's a bonus, action. bonus action. Yeah. Fill the healing potion. Uh, just uh, click on the healing potion. I'm gonna heal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I would say boil. I think, yeah, but I like, think, okay, listen. I think he's happy and dying. <laughs> I think that you make the right call over here. Besides, she can heal boil. That I is need the, to get him that, that puppy. Yeah, that's what I'm it. saying. Uh, yeah, she's back up. She's still prone, but she is um, she's alive again. Um, and that gets us to Boyo's turn. He's going to do another death saving throw. And he succeeds, so he is now stable. So he's no longer dying. However, he's still unconscious. Um, and that is going to get us Ew. to Kia, who has just woken up. Um, he has no idea what the fuck is happening. <laughs> yeah, but she does see that Absolution and Smoke and Joe are absolutely just crazy. So what he's tr she's going to do is she's going to cast mass cure wounds at sixth level because fuck it why not and he's gonna that's going to be yeah. absolution smoke and joe and boyo and herself you all get 22 points of healing uh and so boyo I'm is back up as well which is very the fact that boyo survived this <laughs> is actually <laughs> ridiculous that's yes. actually crazy uh, i like to imagine he gets up he's like did I earn my puppy? You weren't your puppy. Oh, puppy. yes, exactly. <laughs> your puppy. Uh, and then also, <laughs> because she's a um, blessed healer, she also regains two plus her spells level. So that's going to be another it's another eight uh, healing for healing everyone else. Uh, and then she's going to move uh, right here. You move right there. Uh, and uh, it's Absolution's turn. Can't do much from That here. healing of Kia is actually the biggest thing ever. That was so insane. This way. All right, you're under the dragon. <laughs> that's fine. Let me just d get the dragon away over here. That's good. Mm. I don't. I don't right think here, you can do anything not, really. Not really much to be I can do. Yeah, I don't think you can do anything. I mean, I guess you can shout towards Kalen. Uh, can I cast Formaturgy? <laughs> sure. Then it's gonna yeah. hear it. Yeah. So I cast Formaturgy and say, Kalen, do you fancy your chances? Face us like a man. Oh my god. Silence from Kalen. I mean. Would you even be able to hear me? <laughs> I mean, maybe not. <laughs> fair point, fair point. So it's my turn then. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, you can, so I, I will I give you another, I'll around. give you one more perception check to see if you can walk through that rubble. But that's the last perception check I'm going to give you to see this. If not, then then you are cornered. And I would put this at a, I would put this at a, I'll put this at a 15. Ah. That is, uh, you were in... right there, you were cornered and um, you were basically cornered there. You were unsure where to go or what to do. We just gotta get into Kaden into range of Kaden now. I have to ask if if I can get him to come to us, can yes. you kill him? Wait, who I me? <laughs> Rice, can you kill him if I if I bring him close to us? Um I can I can kill him if I'm next to him. Well he I've still hasn't got... done anything, so what if I told you I can make him just walk towards What are you gonna do, Kaden? I'm going to do the following. Yes. If I'm just gonna move here. Alright. And I'm just gonna hide. Alright, roll a self check. Yeah, that's gonna be easy. Oh, I don't like where this is going. <laughs> oh my god, bro. <laughs> the last no one those freaking checked. woes. That's a five. I can't believe All right, it's a, it's a five. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna mark you as like unseen right now so that they don't Shit. exactly know where you are. And then, um, yeah, we'll see. Uh, well, it is now Smoke and Joe's turn, though. Um, what do you, okay. you want to do? I, I, yeah. I want to just turn to Absolution and say, do you think you can take him out on your own if I roll him out? Well, we don't know he's hidden, so I have to act from, as if I don't know he's yeah, hidden. We, we know he's yeah. gone into like the area. We can't see him anymore. Uh, so I fuck. probably could take him on my own. At close all right. Course. That's all I need to hear. I'm, I'm going to slowly start inching towards him. I think that's, that's how I'm going to see me for it to take effect. Is it seeing? Seeing. You can also hold your action until like you see him or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll hold the Okay. Uh, okay, so it's going to be Boyo's turn. Now he's back up. I want my puppy, but... What happened? He's just gonna um, uh, play his flute. <laughs> Has nothing to do. Thank you, Blue. Now, Kia, um, I was thinking the following. So this is actually pretty interesting. So um, the o so Archbar is a smear at the wall, right? Because he is at the center of the explosion. Um, now there are parts of Brazado, Ido, and Ryan Dale left. Now, no way she has a rest. She has revivify. Uh, that's a third level spell, and I think she actually has three of those left. Let me double check. Uh, let me double check. Uh, yes, she has three revivifies left. Yeah, she's gonna bring back, um, Brazado. It's a revivify. So, um, he's gonna get one healing, which gets him to one HP, and, uh, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna rule that he's still, uh, unconscious. unconscious right now, because he's, you know, and also, he's missing, like, an arm and a leg, because, fine, you know, but, we can't do anything. He's no longer dead. And uh, then Kia is going to say, I can save the others. 
And she's gonna... Oh, wait. I can't... I don't think she can move that far. No, she cannot. Uh, she can move here, though. And she's gonna try to save Ido and Ryandale next turn. Um, okay. But yeah. Absolution, it's your turn. Move for me. Trust me. It's crazy, man. I want to finish this now. Down that way. But you can't, can't see him right see now. Anything. Can I do an investigation check? Or am I not close enough? Uh, how... how... I move 40 foot. Um, you would have to go into the sort of um, alcove to... Like, okay. really. I, I can't move any further. Ahead. Well, you can use Step of the Wind as a... Uh, spend a key point to use Step of the Wind as a bonus action to move another 40 feet. And then I would give you the... Um, and then I would give you the investigation check as an action. I'll wait. I'll wait for Smoking Joe. Kalen, um, you move or are you just going to stay hidden? Um, I would like uh, to be able to see myself. Sure. There you go. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, no worries. Um... I would like to try to sneak out. I would like to still be hidden and sneak past them. I will say that I, I can give it to you, but it's going to be on at disadvantage because you are almost like in, in like plain sight and you commit to the walking. So if you're out there, then you're out there. So that's basically the thing that I'm going to give you. That's a pretty high roll. So I will say that you are pretty much hidden until uh, any of them like spot, with, spot you with a perception check or uh, an investigation check. Oh, wait, I, uh, yeah, it's like it's like, it's uh, uh, thirty faster. feet. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You can get to like next to the dead cultist too, like against the wall. Yeah, you can get pretty far. If you're hugging the wall. Yeah, that's pretty much fifteen that's feet, fine. and then you can do another fifteen feet. So you can almost get to yeah. here. Yeah, I can get to here. Yeah. All right. You stay there. Yes. Okay. Um, Smog and Joey would have to make a perception roll above twenty for twenty four or above to um perceive Kalen. Otherwise, you do not perception. see him. You do not see. Know. You do not see Kalen. Uh, you still think he's in that alcove. I'm holding an action. Well, I mean, what are you holding? I'm holding I'm the holding the crazy thing. Yeah. But he's he you would think that he has not. He, he, you think he doesn't have visual on you right now? Yeah, I'm just gonna go to the entrance place normally. Then I can oh use my, my action to move again, right? Yes. Move again to the entrance right here. So uh, assuming that, that he can see, and then I use the held action, assuming he's on the inside, and I use the spell Vishnu's imitation. Okay. Because... So Smoke and Joe, you all see, or like those who are there. You see as Smoke and Joe starts lifting up, he almost gets the wings of the phoenix himself. He starts slowly I, lifting I up. I have a gift for vision. And all of a sudden, eight hands stretch out from his back, <laughs> and they all show middle fingers. Bam, 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 bam. And he screams. What do you What do you shout? The hell do I shout? I don't know. <laughs> Kalen, get your sorry ass out here. I guess I intimidate, right? Yes. Uh, 23 against intimidation. Uh, so I would say that's a wisdom saving throw. Oh wait, you're you're um you're immune against frightened. No, no, he's just enraged. That's how he's intimidated. No, he's uh, immune right. against being frightened because you all frightened. took the you all took the because of feast. the hero's feet. Even though it's a very cool visual, it sadly does not. It's a very quite work. cool visual. I was hoping he'd get mad and hit me, but then I realized the wait. And yeah, that does not sadly does not work. Well, now it's Boyo's turn, and Boyo's going to do a perception check. Against what is the stealth twenty four? Yeah, I mean, I did. It would have been honestly, if it would have been a natural twenty, I would have actually shit my pants. Like that would have been insane. <laughs> yes. Imagine Boyle's just like, hey, wait, he's leaving. Burzato is gonna do a um a Constitution saving throw with three. If he wakes up immediately, he does not wake up right now. He's still asleep. Uh, and then it is Kia's turn. Uh, now I will get Kia a perception check as well. Now she's a plus five. Oh my god. Yes. So Kia sees Big Kaylin. Kia. I don't know if she has anything left. This is actually insane. Uh, <laughs> she doesn't have any attack spells. I only took like healing spells with her. Can Kia tell us that she sees Kaylin? <sighs> well, she screams, he's there. But does he have... oh, she has Guiding Bolt. Lining. That's perfect, actually. Wait, can I use this as a higher level spell? I can. Let's do it as a fifth level. I'm going to... Okay, this is going to be... Ooh, it's a, it's an attack roll, but I think it's worth it. Okay, she's going to cast Guiding Bolt at fifth level uh, against Kaelin. Oh, I don't think it hits. I think you have like 16 armor class, right? Yes. Fuck. Okay, she shoots a light uh, Guiding Bolt towards you and it hits the um, edge of the cavern and both Smoke and Joe and Absolution look in that direction. And I would say that... Um, yeah, I mean, it's like, it's rough, but like, I will... I will just give him that they know where you are now. It's like, because otherwise yeah. we will be sitting here for another two hours <laughs> as well. Yeah. Uh, so uh, absolutely, it's your turn. You, you see him now. I move I move in uh, right. to strike. 
All right, go for it. Go attack rolls. Uh, with stunning strikes. Abs okay, first of all, uh, just uh, do attack. That does not hit. That, uh, that does not hit. No, that just doesn't hit. That does hit, definitely. Um, uh, Kaylin, make a constitution saving throw. Uh, you are stunned. Uh, also do that damage. Wasn't the stun, that wasn't the stun roll, though. That was just the attack. Right, oh. but, but stun is, is stun automatically. Uh, they are automatically stunned if they don't succeed the constitution saving throw. Oh, 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 right, right, right. Gotcha. So, uh, so you're now stunned until the end of um, their next turn. Man, what a twist. Do you have this thing planned out from the beginning? Yes. Uh, basically, I asked I asked uh, Hero if he wanted to be the, the bad guy. Yeah, in the beginning, I was uh, actually going to be just a slave. Yeah, but I was, like, I was like... And I was think I, I literally, from the very beginning, I was like, you know... I might want to give them like someone who's a who's a traitor, but I then it didn't work, and then you were all just weird, really weird um, uh, classes, and I was like, you know what? I don't know if it's gonna work, but then I gave you like so many people, and I gave you key, and I was like, you know what? Why not? It's gonna be fun. Uh, okay, I don't that's think you six, expected six, us to kill the dragon. That's six damage. Uh, do you know do anything else, or <laughs> am I able to do? A bonus action attack or... uh, yes, or if you still have a key point, you can do also two attacks uh, if you have still have a key point and you do um. Uh, flurry of blows. I still have a key point, so I'll well, do flurry and of blows. Do, yeah, and you can attack two more times. And they are going to be at advantage because he's stunned. He's stunned. That hits, and that is a natural 20. So let's do the first one first, the normal damage roll. That's six damage, and then the second roll with critical hit. That is 20 damage! Can I half the second Let's one? go. Um, yes. I will say you can, even though I think that that's fair. Yeah, you can. Okay. And then I have the second one. Um, all right, that is your reaction. That is going to be your turn. Now, Caitlin, it's your turn. However, you're stunned until the end Damn of your it. turn. And now it's Smoke and Joe's turn. Uh, that is sadly how stun works. It is very, so, very rough. Let me just put out Vishnu's invitation. Yes. Uh, as you can read, I proficiently in strength and constitution seven. You can intimidate twice, so I can't use spells. You cannot use spells, yeah, sure. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I am 50 feet exactly. Yes. Face. What are you Several gonna, times. You're gonna stab him in his face with uh one of one of the knives. The daggers. I I, I have a dagger. Go for it. Stab. Attack. Uh, that's uh, gonna be two attacks. That's gonna be a natural one. All right. That's not gonna hit. That is going to hit actually, which is pretty crazy. Uh, I, I, I'm surprised. I fall. Yeah. That's seven, seven damage. damage. Can I stab him in the nuts. Sure. You stab him in the nuts. I stab him in the nuts. He stabs you in the nuts. Spawns for okay. Ragbar. I think that's it, right? Okay. Um, Boyo is going to run. Because everyone, he sees everyone attacking Kalen. He's going to use his um, action to uh, to do a dash action. And then he's going to use action surge to do two more attacks. And use his bonus action to attack as well. So that's three hand axe attacks. A at advantage because he's flanking with Joe. I can't believe it. It's a fucking 14. No, he doesn't get just plus six. Wait a second. That can't be right. He gets a plus six for strength and a plus four for proficiency. That's, that's an 18 that hits. That's a 23 that definitely hits. And that's another uh, plus four. So that's two. If that's three hits, I mean, nine damage, eight damage, and 11 damage. How are you looking? You're still standing. Yes. Oh, Absolute happy. peace. He is going to try another uh, guiding bolt at fourth level this time. Could be an attack roll again. Yeah. Are you actually serious? Are you actually serious? That doesn't hit by one again? <laughs> How is this possible, man? I mean, it doesn't really matter because I'm pretty sure. Now it's Absolution's turn, and I think that this is pretty much done, oh, right? I mean, check the gift. I thought you could put it on. Oh, I'll get my two attacks in then. All right, go for it. Attack, attack. Miss. That hits. Nope, that hits, and that is a natural twenty again. Uh, roll the roll the critical first. Oh, that's okay. Oh, that's okay. actually going to kill him already, and then the critical actually does the same <laughs> amount of damage. Uh, yeah. Take that, the damage, Kaylin. Hey, yeah. Cotton, yes. do I by any chance have, because I'm a member of the cult, some kind of explosion ring? You do that, not know. Uh, goes off if I, when I die. It, you sadly do not know. <laughs> Take you, the damage, You strike Kaylin. him twice, and Kalen falls down on the this ground. This is your absolution. Uh, unconscious. Oh, shit! He said the name! He said the name. He said Roll the credits. name. That's why your name's that. And that is going to be that. Uh, to basically clean up then, um, he is going to revivify both Ato and Ryandel. Now, all three, like Berzato, uh, Ato, and Ryandel, have multiple, like, limbs missing and issues and, and stuff like that. But they are alive. Akvar cannot be resurrected as he is a complete smear and does not exist anymore. He is the <laughs> only person, I mean, including K. Uh, so you can kill... A Kalen, or you can leave him unconscious and, and take him with you, whatever you want. You want to kill him? You killed Akvar. I yeah, didn't I... kill Akvar. 
<laughs> hey, well, you get... Listen, history is written by the victors, my man. <laughs> you killed him by Brox. They're gonna kill Kellen. Can I do... Can I... May I do, you can the... do it. All right, you're gonna um, you're gonna leave the body here, or you're gonna take him with her. I'll take his head. Sure. You you, yes. you basically you take everything that they have. Uh, and Kia says, "How about we get the freak out of here?" She's going to cast Word of Recall, which is going to get all of you back to her sanctuary somewhere. Uh, what about the what about the little dwarf? She forgot about that one. <laughs> no. I I no. actually also forgot about it. So um, I, I actually I, 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 I want to go. Back. I want to go. I want to go. I want to go up to him and like chuck. No, 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 no. Hear me out. Like, thinks he thinks we're dead. He's gonna come back like really depressed thinking we're dead and we're just in the bar just yeah so <laughs> just, like, you, were, our hearts you out, all yeah. end up back at kia's home temple broken beaten up but against all odds alive and that's gonna be Let's the one shot go. guy guys wow first of all count great job thank yeah. you no, thank you so much that was incredible thank you that's yeah. great